Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to use the Mirror Ruler in Abyss Paint X. The Mirror Ruler is a ruler that goes right down the side of your canvas, or really wherever you want it to be, and whatever you draw on one side will appear mirrored in the other side. This is a really easy thing to access and it can be good for making sure that things are done correctly on each side of your canvas, making sure that they're symmetrical. You're going to want to go up here to the ruler section and click on the icon. You can see there are a bunch of different rulers, but you're going to want to click on the symmetry ruler, specifically the mirror ruler right here. And then you'll see it makes a blue line, which is your ruler. You can adjust where the line is, but this is essentially dividing the two areas. And now if you draw, you will see that it mirrors exactly what you've done on the other side. This is really useful for doing line art and for things like eyes, just making sure that everything is perfectly symmetrical. It's also good for making sure that your sketches are balanced and not lopsided. To edit the ruler, go back into that same menu and you will see right here it has a thing called phase. You can drag this up the bar and it will essentially change where your ruler is going. It makes the ruler rotate and you can have it at whatever level you want. For example, it could be side to side and either side it will now be mirrored. You can also move where the ruler goes by moving this little cross here in the middle right here and then you can drag it to wherever you want it to be. This ruler is also good for making things like mandalas, although you'd probably be better off using a quarter ruler for that. To get rid of it, just go back into your ruler menu and then click off. That will get rid of that ruler. There's other rulers there that have the same sort of feature, but I personally really like the mirror ruler because it is the simplest and it just gets the job done. Personally, I'd say experimenting with this one is a really good idea because of the amount of different things you can do with it. That was how to use the mirror ruler in Abyss Paint X. I hope that you enjoyed and if you did, maybe consider supporting. Thanks for watching. Bye.